All right, the county agrees to purchase the World Golf Village property from someone. Some foundation. A foundation. Mm -hmm. St. John's County Commissioners have taken a significant step toward controlling the future development of the World Golf Village property by voting to purchase the PGA Tour Productions building. Oh, that one. An associated acreage for $5.5 million. That's a bargain. From the World Golf Foundation. The agreement stipulates that the PGA Tour will continue leasing the building until March 2025, after which it will relocate its operations to a new facility in Ponte Vedra Beach. This move aligns with the county's objective of maintaining influence over the property's development rather than leaving it open to the market, which might result in more residential or big box retail developments. Hmm. Yeah, <laughs> I love this, this, this. I love that. Um, we're going to approve every damn development that comes across our desk, except for mm -hmm. we don't want this building falling into development. Development's bad in this case. So, yeah, you know, there's like some big stores out there. I mean, bat, the Bass store going out there, right? Am I saying that right? Somewhere in that area, yeah, yeah. right? Bass Pro Shop. That's right, yeah. It's, a little, it's a little north of there, but yeah. Uh, Commissioners emphasize the importance of ensuring that the property's future aligns with residents' preferences. Oh. <clears throat> highlighting the need to control the vision for the World Golf Village holistically. Oh. oh. Uh, Commissioner Joseph expressed concerns about the financial implications of the maintenance and the redevelopment. Others viewed the opportunity as too significant to overlook. Funding for the purchase includes reallocated funds from the American Rescue Plan Act. Oh, yeah, everybody's using that COVID money for whatever we can. Okay, that's very good. The Capital Improvements Fund and Public Building Impact Fees. Okay. Once finalized, the acquisition will add the PGA Tour Productions Building and 36 acres of uh, land, uh, ancillary land, to the county's assets alongside existing facilities like the World Golf Hall of Fame and IMAX Theater. Mm. Yeah, I am curious. We'll have to talk to uh, Christian about this. Mm -hmm. What the future of that building looks like. Roller skating rink. Yeah, I, I, uh, I think they're still open to, you know, uh, the best possible options and stuff like that. Oh, they are? Yeah, I okay. think so. I, I, That'd be good. Now, can somebody, are they still open to somebody buying it back from them, though? Uh, I think it's they... more of a leasing situation mm. because, I mean, it's such a strong asset. Like I said, I think it was a great purchase for the price. 5.5? 5. 5? So, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I mean, 36 acres, and that's a lot of, you can't build what's currently there. For that price. Right. Are they just sure. looking to dump it? Can't. Why was it so low? No. Well, I mean, the, the PGA wanted the county to have it. Oh, uh, so. it was like a gift. And they yeah. probably made tons of money on it already. Yeah. Thank you, yeah. my friend. Well, the, yeah. the county helped uh, and gave a lot of benefits to the PGA to be there, you mm -hmm. know, when they were trying to get the World Golf Village oh, and some of those scratch things. scratch my back. So, so uh, the county's already heavily invested in that area anyway, so it, it completely makes sense. And... Uh, you know, I think it's a very, very good purchase by the uh, Board of County Commissioners. Okay. Very good. Fun. <clears throat> so there we go. We don't know what's going to happen with it yet, but we'll talk. We'll talk to folks about it. Mm -hmm. Yeah.